the marlin to me is like an art form, you know, you feel so at one with nature while you're performing it, it's just, it's graceful, it's powerful, it's beautiful, it's just, it's a work of art in the air, mate. I train about you know two to three hours a day for marlin. Uh, you know, it's a big commitment, I suppose, but um, you know it's just so rewarding to see you know how people appreciate how different our ways of entering the water. It's awesome. Oh my god! That's got the marlin. <laughs> <laughs> my favourite marlin? Gee, it's hard to decide. You know, it's like choosing between your own kids. Uh, you sure do ask some hard hitting questions. Fern Pool, yep, favourite marlin. So good, Fern What do we do every time we come to a new place? A new pool? We christen it with a marlin. Go! <laughs> no! false, false start, false start. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the colour of the water. Oh, it's the water. Oh, it's yeah, oh, there's definitely, definitely a lot of competition when it comes to the marlin. And it's all friendly, it's all good, and it does nothing but improve the game. But, you know, when you see another guy and they pull this absolute ripper of a marlin, you know, all it does is make you want to improve yourself, and you end up doing things you just never thought you'd be able to do. Actually... This brings me back to a really good memory of um, when we were in Karajeni National Park in Western Australia and uh, Matt Litchfield and I walking past this, this little gorge here and uh, telepathically, mate, minds connected, thinking Marlin, mate, thinking Marlin's here. And I can tell you now, the conditions were raw. 10 to 15 degrees in the water, freezing cold, wasn't very deep. No sun around, so we weren't going to get nice and warm and toasty afterwards. You know, perfect place to prove ourselves as a marliner. So we did it, mate. And looking back on this footage now, just makes me just makes me think that was just awesome. And I can sleep easy at night. And you know, some days I just think about it, and it just puts a little smile on my dial. And I really hope that maybe you'll inspire other people to do marlins that are out of the out of the ordinary anyway i've got it here for you so check it out and you know prepare to be amazed for those of you that don't know the marlin is a highly intrinsic maneuver into the water and it is about to be performed to us get up 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 get I'm not kidding you, Rich. Get the hell in there. Well, the truth is, wherever we've been with Marland, it's just taken off, you know, it's taken off into the stratosphere. Just the popularity has gone. Amazing. Well, guys, you've seen a little bit about what the Marlin's about. You've just had a preview, all right? But uh, now we think we might show you, you know, the creme de la creme, a few of our favourite Marlins and, you know, just really show you a few locations. There's some inspiration. That's right. You know, Go for gold. <laughs> Get this into your guys and get out there and find your own marlins. Well, I'm sailing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I didn't get a message going to my head I am what I am
Jess. My name is Matt, this is the Marlin, and it's for you, Joe. <laughs> well, we actually heard a, um, a tragic story recently about a guy who died while he was Marlin. And, like, you know, that brought such a tear to our eye, and we were so impressed that we dedicated a song to him. And it goes something like this. Once was a man, the man. He liked a marlin a lot. Oh, he loved a marlin a lot. But one day this man, this man, marlin off the top of a building into a parking lot. Out of a parking lot. The ambulance came and they said, "There's not much we can do." Because his head was turning to some kind of goo. Oh no! The way it was so tragic, we didn't know what to do, so we wrote this little song. And it goes, we loved my little lot, but not as man as this man who jumped into a parking lot. We loved my little lot, yeah, but we'll never forget this man. Oh, he was a great man, too. Such a good man. Such a good man. This song is dedicated to you. Thank you. together it's just like a pea in a pod you could you could say it's the glue it makes us stick you know just unbelievable changes to our our friendship you know what i'm saying yeah, yeah. absolutely absolutely yeah. yeah um and look that's what that's i suppose that's what you want that's what we all want to you bring into, the, into the community yeah. like we want people you know to become a, a marlin community yeah. even you know yeah. and it brings people together from all over the globe and and you know even maybe a further thought like you know we try and reach for the stars with the marlin, and there's no limits to the marlin. And we want to we want to see volunteers come in doing the marlin. Maybe we'll get a charity donation thing because you know, and and just get everyone in the community involved. And hopefully, you know, we can help we can help out third world countries with this sort of stuff. Oh, that's right, absolutely, absolutely. Yes. And yes. yeah, you know, we, we'd love to see you know new people getting into marlin every day. You know, it's just we need to build yeah. up that. Make it, make an awareness, a real awareness out there of what the Marlin's all about, and you know that you can, you can do it, and you can help. And I mean, we, we as a group, we're more than happy to, you know, come and we'll have a chat with you. Come up to the street, Hit ask us, us up, a question. Mate. Hit yeah, us up. we have a short few autographs, you know, yeah. Yeah. give you some tips, some techniques, that's, yeah. that's advice. Right. That's what we're all about, mate. Absolutely, we're not in it for ourselves. You know? No, no, no. no. We're, for we're, long we're, haul, in it, we're in it for the long haul, guys. Well, so well, come on, a Marlin phenomenon. All right, that's Marlin what we want. Marlin guys, worldwide. Let's do it. This is the Marlin lads. I'm yeah. Marlin. Yeah. yeah. One, two, three. Marlin! Well, just recently we actually heard a tragic story about a guy who um he actually passed away whilst performing the Marlin. And I was so touched by his dedication that um, I wrote a song about it. It goes a little something like this. There once was a man He liked him all in a lot Oh, I love Tamala. Absolutely. Love Tamala. Hey! Hey! Yo! Oh, shit! What was the question again? 
Well, I have big plans for the Marlin, right? Like, I've been thinking, you know, Olympics, I can see them in the, in the future for it, but, I mean, even just the Paralympics, like, imagine, imagine, right, just a purely epileptic-based event. The Marlin, done and done, the Paralympics, it'll be huge. Is this real beer? Yeah, it is, yeah. Well, actually, we had a tragic story um, not long ago about it. My favourite mountain? That's uh, inside. There's so many good ones out there. And, uh, uh, <laughs> I can't keep the cool, you know what I'm saying? I can't keep the cool when I'm out I'm like, ah, it's so hard to say. Like, keep it cool, you gotta keep it always. Oh, I love some island, absolutely. It's just, it's just so fun, and, and like the rewards you get, like, as, as everyone was uh, um, We actually heard a tragic story the other day about a guy who died in Marlin, and um, yeah, we, we were so touched by it, had his dedication that we wrote a song about it. <laughs> oh. It goes a little something like this. These boys can't keep a straight face No, they can't and neither can I Yeah, we're not good at anything I'll let them be So let's pick up the pace <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah Where are we at tonight? So pick up the pace. Feel the pace. The pace. The Marlin song.